This is Banjo, and today I'm going over the use of trigger zones as an action in a trigger. Starting with the client vehicle, we can see a blue 4 P51 and two trigger zones. Select a trigger zone with the 8th icon under the objective tab on the left, and define the entries, which are radius, as the size in meters of the zone, and name. You can also define the color. The zone can also be set to hidden, so it's no longer visible in the editor. In-game trigger zones are not visible. Next, selecting the third icon under mission on the left, we could enter the mission menu and set up a new trigger of once with a name of trigger one, a condition of part of coalition in zone. We could use any condition we want, but in this example we're using blue four in zone one, with an action of message to coalition, which will send a message to the side selected, which in this case is blue four. And the message is blue four has entered zone one. The final value being seconds determines how many seconds the message will be displayed in game. Taking a look at the second trigger, we could see again part of coalition in zone, this time blue four in zone two, with an action of message to coalition, with the message being blue four has entered zone two. We can now save the mission and preview in game. As Blue 4 passes through Zone 1, we can see the action being displayed. Blue 4 has entered Zone 1. And as Blue 4 enters Zone 2, we can again see the action of Trigger 2 being Blue 4 has entered Zone 2. There are numerous uses for Trigger Zones, defined in various conditions and actions, which I'll go through in later tutorials.